Hi friends, good evening. Today is uh, 10th September 2020. Uh, <coughs> 2023. The time is roughly around uh, 7:30, and we had a detailed discussion about Nifty Bank Nifty uh, based on Ishimoku, Pitchfork, uh, uh, moving averages, and all that. So I don't want to go very deep into uh, you know Nifty and Bank Nifty on the chart side, but uh, definitely I want to discuss something about uh, mid cap and small cap. Uh, see uh, the way in which it ran up. Obviously, uh, I am expecting some kind of a cool off from here, and it is also at a very, very crucial, crucial zone. And uh, we said that uh, this is going to be the target, <coughs> which is forty-one thousand ninety-five. When it gave a rounding pattern uh, breakout, and yesterday it did that target, which is forty-one zero nine five. So, which is a very, very crucial area. And uh, if you take in uh, fortune signals, till now. Uh, from 30,000 to 40,000 odd, there is no sell even in one hour time frame. Even in one hour time frame. But my suggestion is, my suggestion is, whether you are taking it or not, it is up to you. Okay. Uh, my suggestion is, investing anything new or putting your money now, it is not at all advisable. It is not at all advisable. And whatever position which you are holding, please trial with your system stop loss. Please try with your system stoppers. Kindly shift your focus from mid cap to uh, large cap, small cap to large cap, micro cap, don't even touch. Whatever you are holding and maybe it would have doubled or it would have given you 50%, 60%, 30%, whatever it is. You can continue to hold with the strict stop loss. Shift your focus from mid cap and small cap and micro cap to the large cap because many large cap stocks are not at all performed. Uh, in this rally, uh, you know, example, if you take uh, the, the major ones like Reliance, HDFC Bank, Kotak Bank, Kotak Bank and HDFC Bank did nothing in the last three years. Predominantly, it has, uh, it has given zero return. It has given zero return in the last, uh, you know, uh, three years. And we picked up HDFC Bank three days before. So concentrate, shift your focus, shift your focus. Uh, you know from mid cap small cap micro cap to large cap and many large cap stocks are available at a very attractive valuation so kindly look into that so now let's uh, let's go and see that graph which we talked about in mid cap uh, this is basically which i posted yesterday to my members so the market went up like this and now this is the crucial area this is the crucial area and possibility of coming down again to this level is possible and in case if it breaks then this will be the ultimate top this will be the ultimate top and very crucial zone very crucial zone and from here the fall will be massive here the fall will be massive and possibility of taking a support here for a huge run after the fall Okay, it is I think roughly coming around 58,000 or not. Okay, so this is not the place to invest fresh money now. This is not the place. This is not the place. Whatever you are holding, you continue to hold and use your six stop loss. But this is not the time to put money now in mid cap or in small cap or in micro cap. And when it comes to the chart, when it comes to the chart. So this is the rounding pattern which we said based on this rounding pattern that the target will be uh, you know uh, this one which is 41,095 exactly yesterday it did the target okay so now uh, I am not saying that it will not go I am not saying I am not saying that because still if you go here still the room is left still the room is left up to ear or ear i am not telling that but investing fresh money is not at all advisable here not at all advisable here so now if you go here <coughs> and uh, if you go to uh, daily if you use fortune signals and if you go to monthly uh, it gave a fake sell in monthly and from there it started uh, this is the trap area where it gave a sell in monthly and none of the candle closed below none of the candle closed below and from there it really really rocked but if you go to daily <coughs> or if you go to even one hour time frame even one hour time frame till now there is no sell till now there is no sell which I actually again and again uh, showed last week also because this is the sell 
uh, there is no not, no candles close to below the cell and again here also there is a cell no candle close to below the cell and again here also the cell and no candle close to below the cell and the buy started at 30000 buy started at 30000 from here uh, from uh, 30150 to uh, roughly around uh, 40000 uh, you know uh, whatever 40000 uh, you know 41090 roughly around 2000 points roughly around 2000 points so this is the crucial area we are entering so try to be very cautious what you can do simply go to daily frame time frame and in case if the market comes to this level then we can think about putting some money this area not advisable this area not advisable let it comes to this area then we will think about it and if you go to same in nifty it exactly uh, sorry uh, this is a lot of my uh, analysis so if you go here last two three you know this this was the support area this was the support area and it has taken the support on uh, blue and red and it moved up and it moved up so a lot of room left a lot of room left in nifty and the bank nifty and uh, uh, considering mid cap and small cap kindly shift the focus shift the focus to large cap especially you know hdfc bank and uh, you know uh, all the majors all the majors and uh, you can concentrate on metal index i was talking about metal index uh, it is going to do extremely well till the uh, till the december end till the december end so kindly kindly concentrate on this don't put uh, aggressive money now if you are in profit uh, at least if you want to take 50 percent out of the profit kindly do it kindly do it market will give you opportunity market will give you opportunity and uh, you can again uh, you know enter uh, for example if you go to mid cap uh, in ichimoku this is not at all looking good seriously this is not at all looking good so possibility that it may even come down to here or somewhere here everything is possible because the width is widening too much and this is not sustainable this is not sustainable and uh, the same thing happened somewhere here somewhere here and again after it went up so high it corrected and came back to the cloud again came back to the cloud again so possibility that uh, you know we may see that's the same here if you go here this was the same rally which is uh, actually reminding me the, the the recent rally so if you go here at least here it came and touched the blue at least here it came and touched the blue if you go here uh, maybe if i remove all this uh, maybe you can see clear picture so if you go here this is what uh, it did actually uh, you know it went up it took the support exactly at the cloud again went up took the support at the cloud again went up took the support at the cloud and again it went up and came here but in this scenario the fresh scenario it is not the gap is widening much much more this is not sustainable this is not sustainable so be little cautious that's what i'm ready to do say and uh, uh, to fortune signals members so once it gives uh, a genuine sell in one hour kindly kindly exit your mid cap position and concentrate on the large cap so as of now in one hour there is no sell once it gives the sell in one hour once it gives the sell in one hour <coughs> kindly exit all your position and we will shift the focus to one day maybe we will come and try to take the trade somewhere here the quality ones not everything the quality ones somewhere here okay so that's my humble uh, submission uh, decision is always yours decision is always yours again and again i'm saying i am not a sebi registered investment uh, advisor so kindly do your homework or consult your financial advisor okay so now coming to nifty and bank nifty i don't want to go and talk about the chart of nifty and bank nifty we have done a lot of analysis so now 8th september is very very crucial so mark the high and low and till it is going to hold 4th September high and low which is the combination of two planets you don't need to worry about the market you don't need to worry about the market okay so I have already marked the high and low now this is going to be a benchmark for you for the coming week this is going to be the benchmark for you for the coming week 
and when it comes to number it is already given roughly around 500 points from here and 1200 whatever and all it has given uh, based on the numbers tomorrow i will give this number tomorrow i will give this number okay so now uh, coming to our prediction which we predicted uh, uh, last month that uh, again august 26 will be the bottom and 14th october will be the high so for example till it holds 25th low because 26th was holiday till it holds 25th low the next top will happen on 14th october 14th october but don't try to believe completely don't try to believe completely use your system use your system that is what it is going to save you okay so till we are uh, the one hour is in you know uh, 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 blue or in green in my fortune signals we will continue to hold our long position but again when it comes and gives the sell position we will exit but this is this is what it says till 2024 these are all the dates which you need to watch out for this is for 2024 this is for 2024 okay so now i'm again i'm saying 26th august will be the low 14th august october will be the high 12th november will be the low and 13th january will be the high and as of now 12 25th was the low which it marked already and we predicted this uh, 15 20 days before okay so now we mentioned last week that nifty is at the deadline in fortune signals do or die is coming week this is what we mentioned in our last weekly forecast video based on uh, the red and blue uh, of fortune signals exactly again it took the support at the red and it moved and it moved so the high made is this one and the low made is this one again you know this is a very important gan number 19432 okay again uh, this is the i made and this is the low made so till this week that is last week high and low is intact you don't need to worry about market you don't need to worry about market okay so september high and low for fresh position above september 8th i you can definitely take a position and we clearly mentioned on thursday that bank nifty futures numbers converged wait for 750 points move and in the last two days 750 points done 750 points done so always remember whenever the number converge whenever the number converge it will give 750 points move it will give 750 points move for example so how to get that number for example if you go here on thursday so all these numbers all these numbers inside 144 number it means it is converged it means it is converged and that is why we said once it is converged we will see 750 points move in i was expecting this to be happen on thursday itself but it happened on uh, thursday 450 and friday another 300 points so this is a simple number of convergence and if you see all the numbers are getting very narrow very narrow very narrow and that is how uh, you know it gives the bus so since now it is moved above uh, the convergence is got nullified the convergence is got nullified so it has already given 750 points up okay uh, this is a member area uh, which are given to uh, the people okay so now rocker of the day of uh, friday is conquer an idea and we are holding many stocks uh, in our radar uh, and uh, we are not holding bank nifty we closed all the bank nifty position yesterday evening around you know 325 uh, sorry 315 we closed everything uh, in bank nifty but we are continuing to hold nifty we are continuing to hold nifty. okay so now uh, coming to numbers uh, all the numbers are looking good so you don't need to worry about it till it holds this number nothing to worry about nifty future for the coming week again uh, the number last week all the targets are achieved last week all the target was achieved and uh, now this is the fresh target for the coming week okay and sell below this number and again if you go to bank nifty all the numbers are looking good and this one number knows everything this one number knows everything okay and again buy above here and all the targets uh, we have mentioned here and sell below this all the targets are mentioned here. okay and exactly last week the bottom was 43,830 and our number for 2023 is 43,820 this is the number for 2023 only one number 
one number knows everything about the market for the entire 2023 exact low was 43830 and from there the move started one rupee difference one rupee difference okay so now coming to time cycle uh, tomorrow we have uh, loop in uh, tomorrow we have loop in because sunday is holiday so we need to consider uh, you know loop in uh, tomorrow and we talked about uh, the combination cycles today i showed to my people from 11th to 15th where all the combinations are happening which counters we need to watch out for those who missed that webinar uh, today uh, i will be giving the the stocks in my youtube shorts tomorrow so kindly watch out for but today i showed all the combination stocks for the coming week till 15th september and tomorrow again we are getting lot of combination and 14th september is the mega day for nifty and bank too many combinations are happening too many combinations are happening on this day and many stocks are coming again back to six combination seven combination eight combination and all that so kindly have a watch and uh, of course uh, we are talking about adani port adani and everything so kindly have a watch and we are holding adani port and adani enterprises so let's see uh, what uh, the market is going to offer us uh, in the coming week that's all nothing more to add again saying i am not a sebi registered investment advisor so kindly do your homework or consult your financial advisors before taking any financial decision uh, see you soon tomorrow with the magical number of nifty and uh, if there is any combo timing and uh, let's see uh, people are talking about very good about uh, g20 uh, and uh, pranam to modi for all you know doing all this work and taking india to great heights let's see whether uh, market is going to cheer up the g20 meet on monday morning with a possible explosion fingers crossed <laughs> but i am not believing in all that but many people are talking about that let's see uh, whether it is going to give a blast opening on monday see you tomorrow at 9:15 until then good night